Ewald Vierda is general counsel for video slots. Now you're behind the consumer protection zone. Can you tell me a little bit about how it works? Well, we are, we are sponsors of the consumer protection zone because we believe that it should be at the heart of the industry. And this event is at the heart of the industry, so we believe that the consumer protection zone belongs in the heart of this event. Uh, that belief springs from our own approach to customers, which is that it, it's all about customers. We are very customer-centric and focused. And we just want to give the customer what the customer wants and needs. And that includes responsibility, that includes the rights of a customer, that includes the, the, the normal entertainment that the customer is after. That's really what we are about, isn't it? Entertaining customers. And in terms of protecting the customer or the consumer, how do you identify someone who's at risk? We have a number of uh, algorithms running all the time in the background which profile customers and which also alert us to, to, to changes in the behavior of a customer. And if and when we see that, we try to interact with the customer. And we are just launching now, uh, at, at this time, a uh, completely new initiative for the industry, which is that in partnership with Viraya, we're applying CRM technology to responsible gaming. And we are contacting customers with automated interactive voice calls. And that means that the number of contacts that we can do, uh, and also our insight in what effect does it have, can increase dramatically. So that's, that's an industry first, actually. And so what is to stop a consumer jumping from one platform to another? Well, ultimately, not so much. Not so much, although a customer can always, of course, opt to, to opt out altogether from all platforms uh, using the, 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 uh, the national cross-operator self-exclusion scheme. And there is one here in the UK and in several other countries. Uh, so that would help. But also, most responsible operators now uh, keep, keep in mind that customers play at more than one casino. Tell me a little bit about, about the, the award and how much it is. Uh, the award uh, is about 50,000 as I understand it. And it will, uh, it will go to one of the charities who are, as a matter of charity of course, in this field trying to, to help the industry and the customer uh, to, to turn entertainment, with, as gambling is, into a much more responsible thing. So one of them, for an example, uh, who, uh, who last year, I think for the first time we're here, was the, uh, the trust that, that is concerned with youth. Others are concerned with, uh, with, with the aftercare and so on. Uh, there are charities who, from various angles, try to help people. And I think we should support that as an industry. That is part of it. As an industry, we do one part, and these charities do another part that we cannot do. And we should support that.